In this video, I will show you how to send automated WhatsApp message to your home decor business lead without doing anything manually. So whenever any new lead is arrived via your Facebook lead ad form, an instant and automatic message will be sent on his WhatsApp number. Now, to send or receive these WhatsApp messages, we will be using this Vati application, which is an amazing application because it has the access of official API of WhatsApp. In place of Vati, you can also go with other applications like AI Sensei or Interact or etc. Now, how you can create an account in Vati or how you can reach out here I will attach a separate video or a documentation in my description box you can refer that documentation and then come back here once you are logged in in your Vati account and once you are logged in here after that you will have to integrate your Vati application with this Facebook lead ad form application basically we will have to build a connection in these two application and for this connection we will be using an automation and integration software called as Pabli connect and it is an amazing software using which one can connect to multiple applications and automate multiple tasks okay I am an existing user of Pabli connect so I'm already logged in here you can create your free account in Pabli connect in just two minutes from this sign up free button and in the free account you will also get free tasks to test these kind of amazing automation now once you will log in and reach out to the dashboard of Pabli connect click on this blue button that is create workflow and then provide a random name to your workflow to your automation okay so I have directly pasted a random name something like send automated whatsapp message to your home decor service lead okay and after that I will be selecting the folder in which I want to create my automation workflow okay so how about I go with this main workflow folder and after that I'm clicking on this create button and you will find two boxes so these boxes are called as trigger and action and here the trigger means when this happens an action means do this so whenever something happen in your first application then automatically do this in your next application okay so in this way you need to always choose your applications in this trigger and the action window in which you are building an automation okay so according to our use case I want that whenever any new lead is arrived via Facebook lead ad form application then automatically send a message using Vati application okay so that is why I am selecting the same two applications in this trigger and the action window okay so in this way you can add as many as action steps as you want by clicking on this plus icon and connect different applications with each other and automate complex business processes okay and now in this workflow in this use case I will be connecting these two applications one by one with the Pabli connect okay so let's first connect Facebook lead ad form with the Pabli connect so that we can capture the lead data inside this dashboard so selecting this trigger even that is new lead instant you can also read the instructions triggers when a new lead is submitted in specified lead generation form associated to your Facebook page so yes I want to perform the same now I'll be clicking on this connect button clicking on add new connection clicking on this connect with Facebook lead ads and then you will have to provide the access of your Facebook account in which you are running ads but because I am already logged in so it has detected that access already and automatically and the authorization is successful and my my Facebook account is immediately connected with the Pabli Connect and because we are connected whatever the pages are already available inside my Facebook account have started visible here so I will be selecting which page okay so the name of my page is this home decor okay so coming back to the dashboard of Pabli Connect and searching for the same page that is home decor okay so I have selected the page and as soon as I select the page you will notice whatever the lead generation forms are available inside my home decor page will start it visible here how about I even show you the same okay so this is my page firstly I'll be clicking on this meta business suit okay and after that from the left hand sidebar I'll go to 
all tools section and from here i will click on this uh, instant form section okay let me check whether it is visible to you or not and here we have the instant form section and here you can find all the lead ad forms okay now which particular form i would like to integrate with pabli connect okay so this is the form that is home decor lead inquiry form okay so coming back to the dashboard of pabli connect and finally i'm clicking on this button but before that i'll be selecting the same form and clicking here and you will notice that it will start waiting for the response which means it is actually waiting for the new lead entry okay but before i make any new entry you will have to read the instructions that is please note that after clicking the save and send test button you will need to generate a sample submission of your lead ad form by clicking on the preview form button and by filling out the form make sure that the lead generation form is live okay so basically it is asking to generate a sample submission of your lead and make sure that the lead generation form is live but because i'm not running any live ad so i will make use of facebook lead ad testing tool now how we can use that tool how you can reach out here either you can search for the same on internet basically on google that facebook lead ad testing tool or you can also visit this documentation directly by clicking on this learn more option and if you will scroll a little bit you will find the link for the same tool okay but i will be closing this page because the same page is already opened here which i have already shown you initially okay so here you can notice the page i have selected is home decor and the form i have selected is same okay so in this way you will have to select the page name and then form and then using this lead ad testing tool you can actually make a dummy submission okay so i have already added the dummy details how about i click on this next button then i'll be clicking on the submit button and as soon as the submission is done you will notice the same form submission data will be received here as a response okay waiting for the response and you can notice the response is received okay now i'll show you the details one by one here you can find the same dummy email address the same dummy name the same dummy phone number and we have further details okay so the presence of this data clearly shows that the connection in between our facebook lead ad form and pabli connect is working absolutely fine okay so now onwards what will happen every time someone will submit that this facebook lead ad form the details will be captured via pabli connect instantly because this trigger will instantly capture new incoming data and the workflow execution will start in real time okay so the first step of our automation is done now once you have the phone number and the basic details of your leads of your users you can easily send a whatsapp message to your lead okay currently i have captured a dummy number but don't worry i will replace this number with my genuine whatsapp number okay so moving further selecting the application that is wati for sending the whatsapp messages and now selecting the action event that is send template message now what is this template message all about i'll explain you about thing later for now go with new connection and for the connection it is going to ask you the endpoint and this access token okay so you will have to click on this api docs section okay so i am already logged in in my wati account now i am selecting this api docs section and from here i am going to copy both the data that is this access token give me a second let me copy and come back here asking for the endpoint token so let Let me once again come back and this is the api endpoint coming back and i have pasted the same clicking on save and in this way my wati account will be immediately connected with pabli connect now because we are connected it is asking for the basic details which are actually required for sending a whatsapp message to your lead okay so like firstly it is asking for the whatsapp number of the person So the interesting thing here is I am not going to manually copy the above details the above phone number from the above steps response and paste below again and again I am going to map these detail so that it can be replaced automatically when our automation will work in real time or in next time so how mapping can be performed you just need to click on this field and you will find the above data here in the drop down now select the data which you would like to prefer which you are preferring okay so i am adding this you can also read the instructions that enter a valid whatsapp number with country code but without plus sign okay for now i have added this but don't worry 
Similarly, I will replace this dummy number with my genuine WhatsApp number. Moving further, it is asking to select the template. So, whatever the templates are already available in my Wati account have started visible here. Let me even show you the same. Let me visit this template section. Okay. So, what is this template all about? Before I select any template from here, I'll explain you everything. So, whenever you send a WhatsApp message using official API of WhatsApp, you will always have to create a new template first get it approved via Facebook and then only you will be able to initiate the conversation with your customers, clients and users. Like in this dashboard, you can also notice that a lot of templates are already approved. Let me even remove this filter and you will find few templates are approved. Few templates are even rejected. Few templates are still into the draft mode. Now, how you can get the approval of these templates or how you can create a template from scratch Again, I will attach a separate video tutorial in my description box. You can refer that video, log in to Vati, create a new template, get the approval for the same and then come back here. Okay, now I'll show you the name of the template. Basically, I'll show you the template which I have created for sending the files on whatsapp to my facebook leads okay so the name of my template is file sharing on whatsapp well i think this is not the same template i think the name was different it was related to general something give me a second i'll show you that once again all right here i have the template name that is general whatsapp template the category i have selected is marketing the language i have selected is english the, in the broadcast title i have selected this media in place of media you can also go with the text or you can also go with none or you can also go with this media and under this media you will find this image video and document okay so currently i'm interested in sending the document basically the brochure of my home decor business so that is why i have selected the same further it is asking for the variable so yes if you want this document to be replaced automatically you can add that value in the form of variable and if i will scroll down more you will find Find the message the content which i am planning to send okay so here you can find the values packed with the curly braces okay so whatever the values you want to keep on changing automatically you can add those values in the form of variables okay so here the name of the lead will appear the company name will appear here the brochure name will appear okay and you can see the preview of that message from this right hand side a footer and button option is already there and it is optional so it is completely up to you whether you want to attach anything or not you can notice in my template i have attached two buttons one is for visit website and another one is for the call phone number you can see the preview for the same and again if you want to learn how you can also create a whatsapp message template along with call to action buttons you can refer my video which i am going to attach in my description box okay and in the sample content you just need to provide the values to your variable basically a sample content or dummy content basically we are telling the system that what values may come it is saying please input valid image url document well i have added this pdf file okay don't worry we will see what we can do here so once your template is approved you can submit it for the approval and once it is approved you can use that template okay so let me search for the same so the name of my template was general whatsapp message template so searching the same keyword that is general whatsapp template with a brochure okay in the broadcast title you can go with any random name so how about i go with send whatsapp message to i'm really sorry for the spelling mistake send whatsapp message to leads okay and lastly it will ask you the custom parameters and this is the most interesting part of Vati because from here only we are going to provide the values to our variable. So how we will be providing the same? Firstly, come back to your application, come back to your WhatsApp template and then firstly count the number of the variables. Okay, so we have one, two, three and four variables in total. So you will have to paste this pair of curly braces for the exact number of time basically for four number of times okay so one is done make sure that you also include a comma after every pair of curly braces second is also done third is also done and lastly fourth is also done but make sure that you do not include any comma in the last variable okay and 
how we are going to provide the values so basically in place of this color you will have to provide the name of the variable and in place of this value blue you will have to provide the value of your variable and again we are going to map the details maximum details we are going to map here okay so let me remove this color and let me check what is the name of first variable okay pdf is the first thing let me copy and paste the same asking for the value so how about i add the link of my interior designing brochure basically the pdf okay so give me a second let me copy and paste the same here all right so i have pasted the link of my brochure and this is something the brochure is something which is not going to vary which is not going to change so that is why i am adding this value manually not via mapping now here comes the turn of the second variable and we have the second variable as the name of the person name of the lead which i am going to map so let me first copy the name of the variable and this time the name is name only okay the name is name only and the value of name is going to be the lead name which i can provide from this drop down so yes i have mapped the same now we have the third variable as this that is this company name let me copy and paste the same here and again company name is something which is not going to change so i can provide this value manually so i'm adding just a random value that is home decor okay now finally here comes the turn of the fourth variable so give me a second let me copy and paste the same here all right it is done and in place of that i want something related to interior designing service and after that i also want this brochure word but i don't need to add that word manually here because in my template that word is already available okay so i think i have provided all the details clicking on this button save and send test request and you will notice that a positive response will be received okay so that means my automation is working absolutely fine but the message is not sent yet because currently i have sent this message to a dummy number so give me a second let me provide a genuine whatsapp number my whatsapp number so that i can show you how your whatsapp message will look like to your business leads okay so give me a second for the same all right so i have provided that number clicking on this button save and send this request waiting for the response to be received and if that response is positive that means my automation is working absolutely fine let me refresh my whatsapp web and here you can notice the messages received and it is the same message that is hello demo user thank you for showing interest in home decor someone from our team will call you shortly in next 24 hours and will listen all your requirements meanwhile you can check our interior designing service brochure given as the attachment with this message and this is the interior designing service brochure okay and it is actually a downloadable brochure okay so in this way with the help of this automation software pably connect you can start sending the whatsapp message along with the pdf brochure attached to your facebook leads instantly and automatically okay and once this automation is ready after that you can even close pably connect sit back and relax because pably connect will take care of all the task in the back end you do not have to do anything manually just make sure that you keep this automation workflow enabled basically on okay and uh, just in case if you want to access this two step automation workflow inside your pably connect account i will also attach the link of my workflow into my description box so you can click on that link sign up for free into the pably connect and then you will be able to access the same workflow inside your own pably connect account that to for free not just these applications you can integrate multiple applications and automate your business with pably connect you can ask your queries at forum.pably.com my team will surely answer to your questions this is the website of pably connect and for the latest updates of pably connect and unique automation ideas you can join our facebook group that is formgate.deals if you have found this video helpful in any way share it with your friends and colleagues and also help them to automate their business like share and subscribe thank you for watching this video